Good morning and welcome to, I think it's day 20 of my trip. It's either 20, 21, 19, something like that. They're all kind of blurring in together anyways. So yeah, I've spent the last couple of days just resting up because there haven't been tournaments that I've wanted to play. Uh, however, today I'm going to go over to Parachute and play uh, one of the 1pm daily tournaments again. Uh, we're going to focus on this one and we're going to do something a little different for the vlog. I'm going to attempt to record every single hand and I'll reveal every hand, even the hands that I fold, um, and go from there. Now, I'm going to attempt it because who knows how fast the, uh, the table's going to play and I might not have time to accurately take notes on everything so yeah i might need to mention if some hands are skipped or not but i'm going to try and record what happens in every single hand uh, including the folds and yeah hopefully you find that interesting but before we do that because it's just uh quarter past 10 we're going to head over to the cosmo and grab some breakfast and a coffee and uh get into playing shape maybe not so much shape um get into playing mood so yeah i'll see you over there at the cosmo okay let's uh go through all of the hands for the 250 dollar 1 p.m daily deep stack that i played today you can see that i'm back in the condo so you might uh, be able to deduce what's what happened eventually but <clears throat> let's go through the hands so we start with a 25,000 uh, starting stack. The blinds are 100, 100, 100. And first hand, I'm in the small blind with 10, nine offsuit, 10 of clubs, nine of spades. Under the gun, one raises to 200. I call and the big blind calls. The flop is king, four, five. And I check fold to the original raiser betting 300. The next hand, we're on the button with ace jack of clubs, folds all the way around to me. I raise to 300, the big blind calls. Flop is 743. <clears throat> uh, we both check, so I decide to check back this flop because I just think 743 is a lot more of uh, the big blinds kind of range than mine. Uh, luckily enough, ace of hearts comes on the turn, big blind checks, I bet 400 and they fold. So we win a small one there. Next hand, in the cutoff, I've got ace three offsuit. Um, under the gun, one raises, I fold. Next hand, in the hijack, I've got nine two offsuit. And I fold after a raise and other things going on there. On the low jack, six three offsuit, I fold that. On under the gun two, queen six offsuit, I fold that. Under the gun one, ten five suited, I fold that. Under the gun with king queen suited, I raise to 300. Uh, the player right next to me re raises to 900. Um, the player next to him calls and folds back around to me. I call with my, uh, I guess, big suited connector. Flop is ace two five, and uh, I end up folding to a bet of 1500. Next hand on the big blind with king 10 offsuit. Hijack raises to 500. I end up, uh, the button calls and I end up calling. Uh, flops 997 and I end up folding after a bet and a call. Small blind, 8-2 suited. Uh, ends up that I get to check my small blind here. Uh, flop comes 10-10-7. Everyone checks. Turns a 4. Someone bets. I get out of there. I don't have anything but 10-2 suited. On the button with 9-7 offsuit, I fold. On the cutoff with king-6 offsuit, I fold. On the cutoff, I don't seem to have the hand written down, but it does say that I fold. On the hijack, 10-5 offsuit, I fold. On the low jack, I have pocket eights. I raise to 300. Button calls, flop comes 6-7-3 with two diamonds. I bet 300 and the button raises to a thousand. Uh, I think a while, I think they can do this with like a six, a seven, uh, potentially, obviously they would do it with sets, they might do it with flush draws, they might do it with uh, three, four, um, three, five, 
Yeah, anyway, I call their raise to a thousand. Turn comes a king, we both check. River comes a four. I check and the button bets a thousand. I think for a while I think they could be betting this with uh, just the seven or a six. Um, so I end up calling and they rivered two pairs, so they had six four. Blinds go up 100, 200, 200. Under, under the gun two, I have five two offsuit, I fold. Under the gun one, I have eight two offsuit, I fold. Under the gun, I have jack four offsuit, I fold. On the big blind, I have six two offsuit, I fold. Small blind, queen six offsuit, I fold. On the button, seven two offsuit, I fold. On the cutoff, queen six offsuit, I fold. On the hijack, I have nine eight offsuit, uh, I fold, there's a raise before me. On the low jack with 4 3 offsuit, there's a raise before me, I fold. Under the gun 2, I got jack 4 offsuit, I fold. Under the gun 1, I have pocket 4s. Um, <clears throat> usually, this is just a, a, a fold here. I don't uh, like open raising with less than 5s in early position. But in this case, I just limp because I've been seeing that sometimes limps have been getting through. Um, so I limp in, small blind uh, calls, and the big blind checks. Flop is ace-jack-6, we all check. Turns at 8, we all check. River's a 10, we all check, and I win with my pair of 4s. Under the gun, I have queen-7 offsuit, I fold. I play under the gun again because a new player has come in and taken the big blind. Queen-5 offsuit, I fold. The blinds go up, 200, 300, 300. On the big blind, I have 10-2 suited. I get to check. Uh, flop comes king seven three with two diamonds, not my suit. I've got hearts. Uh, someone bets, I end up folding. On the small blind, I have queen two suited of clubs. Um, there's a raise, I fold. On the button, king six off suit. I fold. On the cutoff, ace two off suit. There's a raise, and I fold. Hijack, queen five off suit. I fold. On the low jack, eight six suited. I fold. Under the gun 2, 9-6 off, I fold. Under the gun, I have 9-7 suited, I fold. On the big blind, I have 7-8 off suit. Uh, it limps in, I get to check. King 7-3 is the flop. Uh, check, check. Um, one of the early limpers bets uh, 700. Um, I end up calling because I have a pair of sevens here. Turn comes a two, check, check. River comes a queen, check, check. I end up losing. They had a king with an eight, so had me dead there. Small blind, ace eight offsuit, I fold. On the button, queen six offsuit, I fold. Cut off, queen seven offsuit, I fold. On the hijack, ace four offsuit, I fold. On the low jack, jack five offsuit, I fold. Blinds go up, 200, 400, 400. Under gun three, I have pocket jacks. I raise to a thousand. Um, get a caller behind me, and the big blind calls. Flop is ace ten ten. Um, I continuation bet here, uh, one thousand one hundred. Get a caller. Turn comes a four. Um, because the board's paired, <clears throat> I can expect some calls from like lower pairs um, and straight draws like the two Broadway cards um, so I fire again 2,000 because um, I bet like a quarter of the pot on the flop um, I bet again 2,000 fairly small they call river comes an eight um, we both check and they have ace jack so they made the top pair on the flop and we lose there under the gun two eight six off suit I fold under the gun one seven five suited I fold my stack is down to 15,000 at this point. Under the gun, I have king, jack, offsuit. I raise to 1,000. The button calls, the small blind calls, the big blind calls. Flop comes 10, 4, 5 with two diamonds. I have the king of diamonds. I bet 1,000 into like 4,400 or something like that, uh, and everyone folds, so I win one there. Big blind, 10, 8, offsuit. Um, a late position player raises to 900. I call, flop comes ace nine three, and I check fold. Uh, in the small blind, I missed recording the hand there, but on the button, I pick up ace jack offsuit. 
In late position, a fairly active player raises to 900. I re-raise to 3,000, so we've got about 15,000-ish in this hand. Um, so I re-raise to 3,000, and the big blind re-raises to 10,000. So it's, I, I've only got 5,000 more than what they've raised, so they're basically saying they're going to call me, and I think that they don't do this with anything worse than ace-jack offsuit. Um, so the, the original raiser folds and I fold. Cut off, queen nine offsuit. Someone else raises, I fold. Hijack, nine seven offsuit. Someone raises, I fold. Low jack, jack six offsuit. Someone raises, I fold. Under the gun three with jack ten offsuit. I raise to a thousand and a player in position re raises to four thousand and I fold. That was the last hand before the break. My stack is now 12,900 and we're at the first break. Blinds go up to 300, 600. Under the gun two with king four offsuit, I fold. Under the gun one with king 10 suited, I raise to 1200. The blinds are 300, 600, 600. I raise to 1200 and it folds to the big blind who calls. Flop comes 8-7-3 with two spades. I have king 10 of spades. So I have flush draw, two over cards, um, backdoor straight draws. The seven and the eight are spades. Um, big blind checks, I bet 600. They raise to 2,400. I go all in for the remaining 11,700 and they end up calling and show jack eight offsuit. So they flop top pair. River come, uh, turn comes to two, and no spade, and river comes another two, no spade, and I'm out. So that was all hands for the $250 1pm daily deep stack that I played today. Um, I kind of feel like, you know, we got the short end of the stick on the card distribution. Uh, what did I have? Pocket jacks twice, ace jack once, and king ten suited. King-10 suited was the last hand. I had pocket eights, pocket fours, pocket jacks twice. Ace-jack once and King-10 suited were like my top six hands. Um, everything else was like unconnected or unconnected and suited or bad position. Anyway, that's it for today's uh, tournament. Come back tomorrow. We'll be playing bracelet events for the next few days. Um, some of them have quite good structures uh, with deep starting stacks and longer blinds which is quite nice hopefully we can get a deep run have some card distribution go well for me and um, because I feel like I'm playing well um, I started like before coming to Vegas I had pretty positive feelings about like the way that I was playing and um, that I, I would have positive results. They haven't come yet, which is kind of disappointing a little bit, but I still kind of have that feeling inside that uh, something will come eventually. So I think I've got about like se seven to 10 more entries left before heading home. Um, yeah, so fingers crossed things go well. Um, I think I'm playing well, so we shouldn't have to worry too much there yeah, if things don't go well, then maybe I'm going to have to live in a van for the next three years before I can come back to Vegas again. Who knows? Anyway, if you're enjoying my videos, um, click the like button. If you want to catch more of them over the next uh, seven to ten days before I leave, uh, click the subscribe button. It doesn't cost anything. Otherwise, I will see you tomorrow. Bye.